Wait, what are you in character right away? Come on, let's go. She's inside. Oh. What is that? What? What is, did Victoria Beckham have a yard sale? Why are you wearing that? Are you kidding me? This is what you bought for me. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm just saying is it. All right, we're stuck with it. I just think it's a little over the top, but. Thanks. Happy to be here to help you. The first rule of improv is always accept the information. If someone says something, just go with it. No negating. Gotcha, gotcha. Got that it? sounds good. That's smart. In my acting class, when someone says no in a scene, the whole class yells, die! No, no I mean, well, no one will say no then. Don't, don't yell die. Who's up for some warm-up exercises? Oh, no, honey, I'm some not going to do that. The tip of the tongue, the teeth, the lips, the tip of the tongue, the teeth, the lips. But I gotta get it, but I gotta get it, but I gotta get it, but I gotta get it. I got one for you. Shut up! <sighs> All right, let's go already. Are you ready there, Mafia? Hell yeah. Let's do it. Thanks. Smells like kids' feet and like skid mark underwear. Mm. Happy Father's Day. Thank you so much for bringing the kids today. I, I don't think she was the only one who brought them. They, you know what I'm saying? They are my pride and joy. And so I'd like to introduce you to the one and only Kiki D, who came out at nine pounds, four ounces. Youch. <laughs> and then the Whopper, we call him, Bart, because he was a 12 pounder and did some damage. <laughs> okay, so. Hi, you guys. Hello, Palma. Heard so much about you. You're British. So are you all the bird what's been given Daddy the O's love and chico? You sent her to boarding school yes. in, uh, a year, last year in England. Yeah. See, so she picked up a slight accent. It's a very, it's, you know, very Madonna. Yes. What well, is a pleasure meeting you, Kiki D. Wish I could say the same. You see, before you, I had myself a father. I was the apple of his eye. It was all giggling and chasing butterflies in the meadows and what have you. And now what do I got? An hour and a half every other week at J.D. McFunnigan's with him and his whore. Coco! KK! God, she's in such pain. No, that's, that's uh, the pills that she took some out of her mother's bureau. Are you kidding me? All right, let me go see you. How are you doing, sweetie? I'll be better when I start seeing some tokens. He's American. Excuse me, yo, what was that all about? That was raw, and real, and in the moment. You know, I feel very good about it. You do? Well, I don't. So if you want to get your money and your acting classes, you better start doing things right from now on. No more sob stories. And we're stuck with the English accent now, Ringo. So commit to it. Don't choke, got it? Got it. Now hug me and laugh, and let's get back into the show. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, look at this. oh, you're not a whole poem. Okay. That's so nice. See what they do? They fight, then they make up, and it's good. <laughs> Are you kidding me? And a hamburger here for Bart. Art, the water fart. Oh, there you go, kid. Look at that. And uh, two quesadillas for uh, Kiki's. Sneaky with a side of freaky. Here's the water. No soda for you. You're battling diabetes, remember? Huh? Kiki D, I got you two quesadillas because it's your favorite food, so you have to eat it. Well, yes, and um, that's why I'm going to eat every single bit of it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Yes. <laughs> 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 
think we forgot napkins. We did. Okay. Well, let me get the napkins because I know she's not gonna get up and do it because she doesn't like to get up and do anything. Oh, nice. Hmm. Everybody, be cool. So, Bart, your dad tells me you like to go to the bathroom. When I feel it, I do it. What else do you like? I don't know. That's our Bart. He's a man of very few words. <laughs> okay. Maybe I'm upset. Upset about me and your father dating? No, well, you seem to make my dad happy, and that's cool, but... But what? Nothing. Hey, I want you to feel comfortable telling me anything. Well, I just hate that he broke his promise to me. What promise? Yeah, what promise? He promised me last year that he would take me to Hawaii to swim with the dolphins. They have this lagoon there with dolphins, and people get to swim with them. What are you doing? But without warning, my dad can't do the drift. Why would he do that? He met you. <laughs> he what? No! no. Die! No, 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 no! I'm saying that did not. You misread what I said. I said we have to go to Hawaii earlier because I'm excited for all of us to hang out there. We're going to Hawaii? I can't believe I let a six-year-old blackmail me. I saw my shot, and I took it. You're angry at yourself because you got us into this whole situation. <laughs> I did, You yeah. really did. I think old Mary Poppins with the, you can't say no. You can't say no, Governor. Okay, listen, my tolerance for these continued shenanigans is right here. And if it gets up to here, I'm taking my kids, I'm selling you out, and I'm going home. I am so happy we are doing this stand-up. Are you kidding me? We're going to Hawaii? We're going to swim with dolphins? <laughs> it's going to be so much fun. I was just telling the squirt. And now in Seventeen Magazine, she, yes. see, you brought that for these guys? Or is that for you? Oh, it's or? mine. It's my favorite. See that? Did you ever read that magazine? 30 years ago, you did. And hopefully we're going to have time together, right, sweetie? Vent! Vent! On the bar! Danny, Vent! Einstein, I could not stand the beavers out you. Mm. Uh-oh, is this him? I see Sir Colonel Von Generous right here in front of me. Okay, I'm confused right now. Oh, I'm so sorry. I have not introduced myself. We have talked on the phone. But I am Sir Dolph Lundgren, Devlin's man friend slash love monkey. Oh, kill me now. Devlin said you had to stay back and work. I did. She was said nine, nine twos of work. I will work, but I am kaput. You know, I think this is so great of all of you, so mature. You know, I would have loved if my parents had done something. I know. They got divorced. Oh, well, yeah, yeah that's why I was thinking we should have the man come. This is, uh, yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad. It's important for the children to see us as a unit. And also, I cannot stay away from this potato pancake. She loves the schnitzel, you know what I mean? Uh, you know what? Tongue feels a little dry. Let's go get you some water, honey. <laughs> hey, hey. It's a big tongue, a big tongue. Get over here, get over here. You! What are you doing here? Uh, I don't know, saving the day, helping. What you, Hello. What are you talking to? What are you looking at? I can't see in these things. This is what you're going to do. You're going to tell them that you ate a bad sauerkraut omelet for breakfast and that you are feeling like you want to, you're sick and that you got to go. Kevin, I can't go, okay? Why? Because I texted a picture of my new equipment to my ex-girlfriend. Oh, you're disgusting. And I forgot she's engaged to a UFC fighter. He wants to punch me in the face. I want to punch you in the face. Hey, uh, guys, how we doing? Yeah, boy. <laughs> I am just waiting for the money for the ticket. Mm -hmm. So you are coming. And I am paying? Uh, yes, Dolph has zero dollars. Okay. <laughs> Whoops. Let me see if I can find my credit card. Oh, here it is. <coughs> That's for sleeping with my wife, pal.